Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. It's been a while. I have been taking a break um, for some, some issues, but uh, we're fully back. And uh, you must be wondering, what is Irving doing with a Mustang hat? Um, there's a reason for that. Um, today was the day where I completed my online application to participate or be given the chance to acquire a Mustang GTD. You've probably seen that car in publications is a new extreme version track focus version of the Mustang uh, is a completely insane machine uh, it's gonna be limited edition uh, limited production numbers and there's a whole application process to try to get one uh, what are the chances that I might get one of those cars I think very low if I'm honest, that will be probably given to influencers that have millions of followers and things like that, that will uh, probably use the card to do shenanigans and who knows, right? Um, and, and also, you know, in reality, some past uh, four owners that have owned multiple cards or some of their elite cards, and I, I get that completely. I, I don't own a Ford. Uh, the closest I am is, uh, you know, my Jaguar F-Type. It has a Ford-derived uh, 5.0 uh, V8, um, which is uh, the Coyote engine, essentially, um, that is used by, uh, or was used by Jaguar. Um, and uh, it sounds great. I love it. Um, so in a way, I'm enjoying, you know, um, sort of the heart of what it's in, uh, in the Mustang 5.0. Um, but yeah, I, I'm trying. What can I say? I think it's worth doing it. It's fun. Um, I had to fill out a whole lot of information in order to be considered. I submitted a, a video where I explained, you know, what I would do with the car. Um, and uh, really, I mean, if I were to get that car, let me tell you what I would do. I would almost dedicate the channel to the ownership experience of the Mustang GTD. Not only, you know, usage in, in, on the street, uh, I will take it to the track, I will take it to car events, um, I will do community outreach, I mean, you name it. Um, I will paint my garage in four blue, I would have neon signs of the blue oval. I mean, I, I will go all in because it's, it's an incredible machine. Um, I don't know if you read, but Ford is aiming to have that car beat the Porsche 992 GT3 RS time on the Nürburgring, uh, which is a tall order. Uh, let's see if they can make that happen. Um, I don't know when that is gonna is gonna happen. Probably uh, at the end of the spring, towards the summer, uh, where the weather is better in Germany, but. I mean, if they beat that time, I think that will be quite, quite a feat, um, and that's what they're aiming for. The, the, the engineers at Ford, I mean, were given carte blanche, blank canvas, full um, permission to go nuts, um, and that's what I like about this car. It's is is uh, one of those rare times when companies uh, like Ford, particularly. You know, it's telling the engineers, go for it, right? Uh, tell us what it is and money is no object and, and we'll support you. I think that's a great story. And this car is super special, right? The last time that Ford did such a special car was the GT. I have a blue one up here. Um, and what an incredible car. Uh, the last run, now those cars are worth, you know, more than a million dollars each. Um, so I think this you know, is, is something that will be also a, a great investment. It's a limited run. Um, I intend to keep it. I intend to follow all the rules as Ford intends and, uh, and then use that car um, to not just grow the channel, but to share it with people and, uh, and, and show it to the community and, and have fun with it. And I mean, I, I can't wait. That will be incredible. Um, question is then, you know, will I be able to afford it? I might have to sell a few things, including a kidney. I'm not, uh, I don't, I'm not joking, but you know, 
hey, you know, if, if I get the chance, I'll, we'll have to figure out a way to make that happen and, and let other things go um, in order to accommodate this. So, yeah, I think that would be super fun. Um, and, uh, and I don't know how many will be out there, particularly here in North Carolina. Yeah, I'm sure there will be other people way more qualified than me in, in securing an allocation, but I gotta give it a try, right? Um, and uh, who knows, right? Uh, a small YouTuber and I speak multiple languages, you know, I can help with community outreach, I can, I can help Ford reach into other communities, that would be awesome. Um, and, and I'm a car enthusiast, so at the end of the day, it's because I love the car, I love the story, I love what it represents, and, uh, and I love what Ford has done with this, and I think it's super special. In a, in a world where we're all moving into EVs and electric cars and cyber trucks and ugly machines, you know, suddenly Ford dedicates a team to create something uh, at this level. Um, in the next few weeks and months, there will be plenty more footage. This is Mustang week as we speak. I think this is uh, the anniversary of Mustang. And, uh, and they have, I know they have plenty of events planned in different parts of the US. Um, and, uh, and I think it will be incredible. I don't know when they will actually grant um, access or, or tell me about their decision. This is meant to be vlog number one. Hopefully vlog number one of 500 that I will make with the GTD. Um, but yeah, I intend to keep you you know, informed of what happens. Uh, I just submitted my application. I got the letter back from Ford saying it's in and we'll review it. Um, and as soon as I get an answer, good, bad or ugly, well, I'll, I'll let you know, right? Hopefully, hopefully it's good. And then that will be a, a cool problem to have at that point. Um, but yeah, that's, that's what I wanted to share with you today. It's, uh, it's a bit of a, a bit of a, a challenge, I, I would admit, uh, but it's a good challenge, right? And it's a history um, brand, and uh, and I think it's, it's going to be very special. Either if I get a car, it, it will be incredible. If I don't get it, I'll find a way also to document um, somebody that, that has it and, and, and is able to get it. But yeah, let's give it a try, guys. And uh, that's me. Back. There's a few other things and surprises uh, in the channel, so stay tuned. There's other changes into what is happening in my garage, so you will find out very soon. But this will be like insanely crazy cool. So anyway, remember to subscribe, follow us on Instagram and TikTok. I'm going to put all the links below and, uh, and stay tuned. Uh, and let's see if we hear good news. Thank you guys and uh, I'll see you around. Take care.